Welcome back to The Nest, where we are discussing a very important matter of the day, and that is uh, the issue of miscarriage, which happens to a lot of moms, many who don't speak about it, many who deal with it privately because of stigma and a lot of issues surrounding that. What we forget is that not only does it affect that parent psychologically, physically and in every manner possible, meaning relationships that she has with the people around her, we have to discuss this because it is very important so that whoever is watching this, whether you're a mom-to-be, whether you are already a mom who has experienced this, or whether you are a person surrounding this mom, we can have well-equipped manners on how to handle this. And we are very honored to have our specialist of the day who will take us through the psychological bit of miscarriage and how we can conduct ourselves better as these three categories, the mother, the people around them, especially the spouses, and how the mom can go on to the next step. Please introduce yourself. Okay, thank yes. you so much. Oh, my name is Nchebere Morioki. Yes. I am a counseling psychologist. I deal with uh, children and adolescents uh, counseling. Yes. I am a marriage and family therapist. I also counsel in the areas of uh, trauma, mm -hmm. and uh, I consult in mental health issues. Yes. Yes, just to mention a few, okay. because our field is quite wide. Wonderful. Yes. I think uh, what you do is very noble, and uh, you Thank know, we you. always think that mental health is about just being depressed, and that's it. Mm -hmm. But it's a wide scope of that. Absolutely. And again, we are very honored to have you today to talk about this particular issue yeah. of miscarriage, you know, with our mom who also happens to be, you know, a counselor, mm -hmm. and putting our minds together, mm -hmm. we're able to help that person who is watching at home and uh, I think I'm going to just throw the question at, at you okay. and ask you what is the aspect of miscarriage and what are these misconceptions that people have about miscarriage especially in our Kenyan or our third world uh, setup thank you so much for that question mm -hmm. I will go straight to looking at it uh, the misconception mm -hmm. which are so much social yes one there is a mythical belief that mm -hmm. uh, any time any lady or a mother loses a child who is less than 20 weeks, right. they think that is nothing. Mm -hmm. um, there it's was not nothing thing. much that occurred. Yes. And I want to put the records right yeah. that uh, immediately mm -hmm. conception takes place. Yes. There is attachment. Yes which first of all starts psychologically mm -hmm. and then it is manifested in the physical. I yes. hope you've seen women mm -hmm. uh, immediately they, they conceive uh, mm -hmm. like after three weeks, after a month, yes. they keep rubbing their belly. It's it true. is an indicator yes. of a relationship, yes. a connection mm -hmm. and a contact yes. that has already occurred Absolutely. between mm -hmm. the mother and, and the, child. the child they are carrying. Yes. Note carefully, mm -hmm. this first connection mm -hmm. and relationship mm -hmm. starts their nurture mm -hmm. in the mind, in the psychological. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Long before the child is born yes. or is seen yes. by us, yes. the men, yes. the women, yes. the society mm -hmm. and everyone else, yes. there is a connection mm -hmm. that has started being nurtured mm -hmm. from conception. Okay. Now, when this occurs, mm -hmm. No one looks at the woman mm -hmm. or the lady or right. the mother right. as somebody who has started a journey mm -hmm. that is so emotional, yes. that is so real, yes. and that yes. is so anticipatory. Absolutely. One thing is, mm -hmm. once you conceive, mm -hmm. you are carrying a life, mm -hmm. and the society looks at you differently. Absolutely. As much as the mother is expecting and carrying. Mm -hmm. The society also is expecting yes. for a delivery. Yes. However, mm -hmm. this one now is held in ash tones. Uh -huh. So when you lose, mm -hmm. they just, allow me to say carelessly, uh -huh. out of ignorance, right. brush it aside. Of course. They do not look at the relationship that was there right. between the lady mm -hmm. and, the and, baby. The, and the baby. Right. Having said that, uh -huh. The journey of loss mm -hmm. is one of the most difficult 
and especially mm -hmm. uh, when a mother loses a child. Yes. There's one thing we do not look at mm -hmm. from uh, the mother, mm -hmm. that the mother had high hopes yes. of what they were carrying. Absolutely. I believe you've ever heard this statement they say, yes. I could be carrying the president. I could be carrying the next um, Wangari Madai yes. and on yes. and on. Yes. That is such a huge anticipation. Absolutely. Now, mm -hmm. think of it if it's the first pregnancy. Mm -hmm. Or think of it if it's the second pregnancy mm -hmm. and the first one also yes. was lost. Yes. The anticipation, right. the expectation right. is so high. Yes. Now, Another thing we do not look at as mm -hmm. a community mm -hmm. and as a people yes. is the pressure that is unspoken, yeah. that is put mm -hmm. to the lady mm -hmm. by mm -hmm. the husband. Absolutely. Because in Africa, mm -hmm. we become people yes. by fathering. Yes, <laughs> that's why they, when you're not a father, mm -hmm. they'll put you to be a father. You cannot be able to talk to community. You yes. can't stand and yes. talk to people and yes. be accepted yes. as someone. Mm. I don't want to mention where I come from. <laughs> and also, that's yes. why they always say, mm -hmm. you've got a girl, yes. they are waiting for a boy. Uh -huh. So, without me diving into that, mm -hmm. that psychological pain mm -hmm. that a mother goes through right. is so huge. Yes. And to some great extent, mm -hmm. the mothers always blame themselves for Precisely. mistakes that they never did, Precisely. for complications they didn't have an idea yes. about, yes. and mm -hmm. for lack of knowledge that mm -hmm. it occurs to people yes. and it's none of my doing. It's true. And therefore, yes. a lady goes uh -huh. into a journey of self-blame, self-condemnation, mm -hmm. judgment, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. loss of self-worth and esteem, true. True, true. whereby they feel, yes. I am not worth. Yes. Macu, yes. as they go to the river to fetch water, yes. as they meet to go to the marketplace, yes. there are some who are mocking uh -huh. the mother. True, true, true. There goes the one who cannot hold a pregnancy. A pregnancy, yes. And it becomes a huge yes. journey of right. pain, yeah. torment, mm -hmm. and trauma. Yes. So women go through serious traumatic a lot, a lot. pressure yes. uh, after losing yes. a child. Yes, yeah, and, and again, uh, mm. uh, it's the same story we, mm. we were talking about. <coughs> same thing that happened to her. Mm. She dealt with this privately uh, and she was feeling all these overwhelming feelings of did, did I not do the right thing? Will my husband blame me about it? Who do I even tell? Because in reality, in a common setup of normal uh, death. Mm. People come together, they comfort you yeah. Yeah. and eventually you're able to heal. Mm. But in this manner, you're going through this process all by yourself because you're the only one who knows what's happening in your mm. body. Mm. You're the only one who knows uh, the pain of losing that child. Again, she, uh, she was mentioning she was having nightmares. Yeah. Even carrying her children again was such a difficult journey because every time she would just wake up and she would think, I'm going to lose this one as well. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think, uh, again, as a counseling psychologist, you can tell that mom who is at home, perhaps mm -hmm. they are going mm -hmm. through that. And I know there are very many who are Absolutely. watching us today. What would you tell them when, if they come, let's say they've come to your office and they're saying, I'm here, I lost one or two or three, because you can never determine, yeah. and it is, it is real. Like sure. you've put it, the minute that conception takes place, automatically you become a mother and then you lose this pregnancy. What steps would you ask them to take as an individual? And as we go towards that, what steps can the people around them take so that there can be this communal way of comforting this mother? Thank you. Yes. Um, it is very wrong or difficult, uh, first of all, to look at uh, a lady alone. Yes because it takes two to conceive. Absolutely. Unfortunately, mm -hmm. when this occurs, yes. ladies are left alone. Yes. And I forgive you mm. for even asking mm -hmm. what she should do. Yes. Because eventually, yes. a lady, uh, a person must know how to take care of yes. themselves. Yes. But the first step that I always mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. make sure, mm -hmm. because I have dealt with yes. quite a number of yes. those cases, yes. is to make sure that the husband 
or the man mm -hmm. or the owner of the pregnancy, mm -hmm. if I can talk like yes, an African, yes, yes, yes. Uh, accompanies mm -hmm. her mm -hmm. uh, for therapy. Mm -hmm. Now, this is where mm -hmm. I find a lot of resistance and mm -hmm. difficulty. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, the stoicism of mm -hmm. men where they should be seen to be strong, mm -hmm. whereas they are dying from mm -hmm. inside, mm -hmm. comes out. They fail. Unfortunately, yes. To tell a lady, and mm -hmm. that's where I find a lot of trouble, to yes. work with a lady, yes. to accept the yes. journey alone, yes. whereas it was a business of two people, true. becomes a very difficult journey. Very true. However, so mm -hmm. that I can answer your mm -hmm. question, mm -hmm. I always enable them to mm -hmm. appreciate themselves mm -hmm. back mm -hmm. and take a lot of pain to mm -hmm. walk them through, yes. to understand mm -hmm. it was nothing of their making. Sure. Number one. Yes. Number two, mm -hmm. it is scientifically it's a difficult thing to yeah. be proven yes. what happens or what is, is yes. not happening. Yes. And in this case, I'm avoiding to go to the science mm -hmm. world. Mm -hmm. So that is my worst and most difficult assignment right. a journey yes. to make a lady yes. look at it and yes. accept themselves Absolutely. that I was not the making. The making Number yes. two yes. is to make the lady feel a human being, uh -huh. the self-esteem, yes. the worth. Yes. Remember, mm -hmm. children offer identity yeah. both to men mm -hmm. and to women mm -hmm. and that's African. Yeah. So again to restore their self-worth. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm so that a steam can be fair, yes. so that to know, mm -hmm. yes, this happened. Mm -hmm. However, yes. I am still okay, yes. and I can still have other children. And I'm still working. And then having done mm -hmm. that, mm -hmm. we start the journey yes. of self-appreciation uh -huh. and acceptance. Yes. Because sometimes, mm -hmm. the partner right. might have neglected. It's true the other person emotionally. Or, or use the situation to bring her down, mm -hmm. you know, exactly. in worst case scenarios. In worst case scenarios. Yes. scenarios. Yes. And it becomes difficult yes. where a lady or a mother has mm. got like two girls mm. and they were looking true. for a boy. True, true, true. It's very traumatic, yeah, yeah. very painful, mm. because if it was a boy they mm. lost, mm -hmm. it's a very hard journey. Mm -hmm. And then the last one, yes. and the most difficult, yes. is to convince them mm -hmm. that the Lord still loves them and cares for them. Yes. And it, it, it's not that the Lord has forgotten them, yes. neglected them, mm -hmm. doesn't care about mm -hmm. them, and to make them appreciate that sure. God mm -hmm. has the power again yes. to give them a boy and as they desire. Exactly. It's very and difficult. A chance. Very hard journey to walk yes but uh we record we record progress absolutely yeah. i'm yeah. just happy that we are highlighting these mm. items and yeah. uh, i don't know so far mm -hmm. um what is going through your mind mm -hmm. because uh combined with what mm. um uh, we are saying today mm. about appreciating the journey yeah. thinking of again we are worthy of this again mm -hmm. thinking of uh, what should the people around us do uh, is there anything that you feel was done right during your time? Mm -hmm. Which was when maybe things are not the same as yeah, they are today. The People are not sitting down to talk mm, about miscarriages yeah, yeah. so openly. Mm. Uh, uh, you know, uh, how would you have wanted this to be done differently? Or mm. what, after many years, and of course mm. becoming a mom again, what would have mm. prepared you better? I simply want to echo the sentiment of our psychologist yes and to say that mm -hmm. whatever you said mm -hmm. i really recognize with it mm -hmm. that our society mm -hmm. has not embraced miscarriage True. and that True. is why people we, many women don't talk about mm -hmm. it there are those who get pregnant okay he has talked of the couple mm -hmm. but there are those ladies or those women who got pregnant mm -hmm. out of wedlock yes and the father is not known mm -hmm. and then here you're getting a miscarriage it's yes. even a whole oh, it is. it's even stressful right because one mm -hmm. you're a Number two, mm -hmm. you don't get support system. As you've said, sure. during the loss and grief, when mm -hmm. somebody has died yes. within the family, people will come and console you. Mm. But when it's a miscarriage, mm -hmm. it's time break. It was not, it was, it was not something, sure. you know. Yes. And I think it even hurts more mm -hmm. and makes the healing journey 
to be, I mean, to take more time. Yes. Uh, yes. As he has said, mm -hmm. a, a, a baby gives you an identity. Unfortunately, because I'm talking from a mom's perspective, perspective yes. there is no loss mm -hmm. that can be covered with another one. Most people will come to you and tell you, it's okay, you'll get another, get another baby. one, yes. I want to say <laughs> that no baby can replace the loss. True. Allow yourself to go through the process of loss mm -hmm. and grief. Mm -hmm. And people mourn differently. Mm -hmm. Mourn your miscarriage to the, to the point whereby you feel that you, you have a closure. Yes. Why? Because mm -hmm. if you don't mourn to the process, to process your mourning, I remember when I got pregnant, my mm -hmm. firstborn mm -hmm. baby, she's mm -hmm. now in Form 1. Mm -hmm. When I went to the hospital now to deliver, right. again I developed complication. Whoa. In fact, that time we were to lose myself, I was to get, I mean, we developed complication both ways. Uh -huh. It's either two of us to be saved yes. or one. Oh because my. she had tagged herself oh. thrice. Yes. And I went to the theater uh -huh. and I knew uh -huh. when I was confirmed that the baby is not moving. I knew the baby is not there. Oh again, no. I had not dealt with you my loss. You tortured yourself. Yes. Mm -hmm. So when I saw the baby, mm -hmm. I saw... I mean, the world again. I'm still not, not processed. Yes. So when I processed my loss, mm -hmm. that is when I realized that the baby had lost. It was a baby. It was not something. Of course. Yes. As it's the world speaks. It, no, it's not something that can be replaced. It, it, it yes. I had to go through the process of loss and grief mm -hmm. to come into terms. Yes. I want to encourage the moms at home. Mm -hmm. Sometimes the support system may not be there, mm -hmm. and you may develop postpartum depression. True. Again, mm -hmm. people may not understand you, mm. and because people don't understand mm -hmm. you, you 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 walk alone. Mm -hmm. You feel so lonely. Right. You feel neglected, mm -hmm. and you also feel like the world is coming to an end. Yes. You know the way the world gets shattered. Oh yes. Because mm -hmm. it's like the mess is the brain shifting. Like the way he has said, you it's it's with you. you. It's true. In case like now, the way you see it, mm -hmm. somebody is drinking, mm -hmm. somebody is not carefully yeah, yeah. so and all those narratives. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. I want to say like, and I want still to strengthen the point that he said, mm -hmm. that you mm -hmm. also need to know mm -hmm. that life is given by one yes. God. Yes. Nobody can give life. Yes. Because I have worked with people who have gone through ectopic pregnancy, yes. and sometimes you're asking yourself, mm -hmm. the doctor has confirmed that they are. Yeah. The, the both fallopian tubes are blocked. Yes. I've worked with people who, are, who, who went through miscarriage mm -hmm. and they, they were single moms mm -hmm. and the world has been shattered mm -hmm. because yes. they tell me that will I get a man who will accept oh. that I can hold a baby to yes. terms because yes, yes, they yes, think yes. I am the type of, you know, yes. the way miscarriage is associated with, with a cultural it's society, especially some, the it's African. Like something is wrong with you. Yeah, something yes. is wrong with you yes. that you have that, especially mm -hmm. when you miscarry. Mm -hmm. Something is wrong, they start mm -hmm now tracing your culture, mm -hmm. they start tracing your, your family past. line, they start tracing, anything. yeah, anything. and they associate you with this kind of a person yes. that Who I don't want not. to associate with you yes. because your family, yes. I will keep on losing my baby. Oh, yes. The way he has said again, mm -hmm. if you keep on losing, miscarrying boys, mm -hmm. again another stigma. It's true. Because they mm -hmm. wonder, mm -hmm. will you ever mm -hmm. carry for me a baby? Yes. For an African man, yes. it's a boy. It's a boy. But I, 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 I want to Power people mm. in the society to mm. say mm. that embrace the gift of God yes. in the family. Yes. Because you can mm. get one girl mm -hmm. equal to five sons. True. So I think you embrace the journey. Mm -hmm. And he has, as he has said, as a couple, mm -hmm. please walk the journey together. Yes. If it's prayer, pray together. Yes. If it's walk, encourage one another. Absolutely. As he has said, yes. men more differently. Yes. And sometimes we ignore. Yes. Like I want to say, I ignored like mm -hmm. my yes, husband. I felt like my husband was through. not. Yes. Really he couldn't understand pain. what was yeah, going on. Yeah. He was on. not really pain. Yes. You know that's a, that's normal. Another because there is nothing that you. Yes. That he is mourning. Mm -hmm. True. But I felt like I was in this alone. Yes. And that is that happens. Yes. And as he has said, mm -hmm. please let encourage people to go through cancer. Absolutely and to go especially the mental health journey mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. if in case you developed a mental status yes whereby you have anxiety mm -hmm. you have fear mm -hmm. those things cannot be felt dealt with they in normal circumstances Absolutely. you need to sit in a counseling room yes sit with a counselor yes let them walk you the journey mm -hmm. and then in preparation to mm -hmm. now getting another baby getting another i was chance. not prepared right i found myself unfolding stories after stories wow. today i empower mm -hmm. the couples to be True. I do a, prim a thorough premarital counseling program okay. and I encourage somebody to yes. go see a gyno, yes. two of them. Yes. Why? 
because even the hormonal oh, imbalances sense, in the body, yes. you don't know yourself. Yes. Some of them, they even have the type mm. A, yes. the mm -hmm. negative, mm -hmm. whereby yes. you don't know, you your don't blood know. group was yes. not taken, Yes. You, you, the, the, the man is negative or mm. the woman is negative, mm. and then they mm. start losing the baby. True, over well, and as, over again, yeah. when it should be. So yeah, it's yes. a simple journey. Absolutely. Once they go to the hospital, yes. the doctor they inject, uh, and then they're able to save the to, baby. To save the baby. Unfortunately, with a lot of ignorance mm -hmm. in our country yes. and in our society, yes. we need to pass this information to people. Absolutely. Thank you. Wow. Thank you so much. I think, uh, in fact, I was just going in to tell you, can we have this uh, final remarks? But you <laughs> closed it so well, as I give, uh, you know, uh, Mr. Morioki a chance to give us your perspective as a counseling psychologist uh, just as a parting shot whoever is watching us out there and i mean whoever friend husband the mom mom to be a person who could experience this yeah. what is the one thing you can have them carry with them every day from our topic today oh thank you very much our uh, one this is not a one person's journey mm -hmm. it requires all of us yes number two mm -hmm. We are so mythical mm -hmm. that uh, knowledge is need to be sought True. after. True. Mm -hmm. uh, it is not just automatic mm -hmm. uh, for us to have a child yes. and just deliver normally. Yes. It, it, it takes a lot of other things. It does. And information sets us free True. and I mean, um, liberates us. Yes. Last is mm -hmm. that also to the men. Yes. There is need for us mm -hmm. to accept. Mm -hmm. It is okay not to, to be, be okay. okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. And it is okay mm -hmm. to seek mm -hmm. help. Yes. And it is not a woman's thing mm. to say, I am <laughs> not okay. Yes. You can say that again. Yes. again. Yes, I need. I wish yes. I could have. I could it's have true. amplified mm -hmm. my voice more. Yes. Because mm -hmm. men mm -hmm. stoicism mm -hmm. is killing us. Mm -hmm. Culture has taught us. Uh, you know this slogan at Manaume mm Analianga -hmm. Machosi Kingia Kotubo. That is such a myth <laughs> that is true. killing us and yes. killing us. And that's why you notice mm -hmm. men run to bars, men run to wrong mm -hmm. systems to mm -hmm. try mm -hmm. and cope, yes. and which is a negative way of coping. Absolutely. I, mm -hmm. as a man, mm -hmm. as a professional, mm -hmm. and as a psychologist, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I want to tell them, mm -hmm. It is okay to come to therapy, yes. and it is okay to say, I am hurting. Absolutely. It is okay to seek for help. Yes. And there are solutions mm -hmm. about emotional and psychological pain mm -hmm. and trauma. Yes. Mm -hmm. And let us appreciate that post-traumatic trauma yes. is it's real, real. Yes. and it can cause serious mental issues. Absolutely. It can be stopped, yes. it can be taken dealt with, of? it can be yes. taken care yes. of. Yes. All what they need mm -hmm. is to take a bold step uh, absolutely. and seek help. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, thank you so much. Thank you so much. I cannot have I cannot put it any better. Thank you so much for sharing your wonderful journey and encouraging obviously we are not talking about moms today. We are talking about everybody who belong who who's this child belongs to. They say a child is raised by the society. The minute I find out, I'll tell my friend and I'll tell my relatives and we all become parents to these children. Mm. And again, thank you so much for your time and thank you for your wisdom thank as a you. psychologist, counseling psychologist. I'm thank humbled. you for your wisdom mm. as a mom who has survived this traumatic mm. Uh, you know, uh, experience mm. and uh, also for sharing your journey and for doing what you're doing for the society. Right, so what a wonderful show this has been. I've learned a lot and I think the takeaway home today will be a child doesn't just belong to the mother and a miscarriage is a real loss which should be faced like any other loss. Again, it doesn't matter who you are, whether it's the mother, whether it's the father. Message to the men, it's okay not to be okay. Hold your spouse's hand. If you're a friend to a single mom-to-be who has had a miscarriage, hold her hand. Seek counseling, seek guidance, because you cannot escape grief. Somehow it will catch up with you. Sure. And it's good to just face it head on so that you can get a second chance in life and you can get 
a second chance in loving another human being, God willing. Again, God gives and God will give again. That's the message for today. And this doesn't stop here because next week we continue with this amazing, amazing journey of miscarriage. Again, I'm saying amazing because we do not have many platforms that talk about these issues which are real and we need to face them. As we hear more stories from real parents who go through all the issues that parenthood brings and how to solve them. Thank you and have a good night. Mm -hmm.